Hey, this is Maurice Keys coming at you about the Akai MPC Renaissance and Studio version 1.6 update to the software. And basically, this video is about the time correct feature, uh, which if you go to the top right of the software, uh, where we have file, edit, click Metro, uh, metronome and the time correct. If you press time correct uh, and then go to length, uh, you will see where they have added this the abilities of this new feature at. Uh, again, you have the type um, of the note length. You can have just do the end, the length, or legato. Uh, again, making a smooth transition from one event to the next. Uh, then as far as events go, go down to the events. You'll see that you can have all selected. Um, you have the selected range of notes, a selected number of notes, that is, and then you can have a range uh, that you can apply it to. If you uh, do the range, you can see you can go from one certain mark time marker to another time marker, or you can also, uh, I guess, somewhere select certain pads. Yeah. Okay, and then again, as you know, normally the time divisions, uh, the swing, shift timing, uh, the window, and the strength. Um, but this is a great feature. Um, again, it seems like they're, they thought about in this particular update to give us more uh, ability to go into detail in regards to the MIDI events that are created uh, in our sequences. Uh, again, I will go into this further and maybe give a demonstration on the practical use of it in a later video. But I, again, I just wanted to introduce uh, the aspect of this note length quantize where we can adjust the position of the note ends or again, make the notes play legato. Again, I look forward to bringing more stuff to you guys. Uh, subscribe or, you know, like me or something. And uh, so you can keep in touch with knowing when I put up another video. Peace.